Hey, we are back with Professor Avro Merlich, and tonight we're going to talk about something we never talked before. Theoretical f- physicist Kip Thorne sets a stage for an incredible image of how the universe functions. Collapsed gravity, twisting in space. The shapes are not the same as we know them in this earth, in this reality, in this dimension. But in another dimension, or many millions of dimensions, perhaps in anti-dimension, they do exist. But the shapes, it seems, are coming through our own imaginations. And we are perceiving them. And we are visualizing incredible shapes of the universe that cannot be described in language and in grammar, but they reflect almost like quantum communication, almost a form of communication that we as humans have not developed, or perhaps we have developed, but we did not even know it. Perhaps the chirp of a bird is quantum in nature. They are now saying that the quantum energy the impact, uh, the hawking points from collapsed gravity was the first fertilizer, the embryonic sowing of the seed into the first DNA, an RDNA. And that it is the very source of consciousness and it exists in every part of nature from the rock to the vegetation to all the other sprouting types of vegetation to life and to soul. And now, with the development of human society, possibly it is time again to capture the quantum state for the development of uh, society. In mysticism, there is an idea of a common soul. soul. The common soul, a mysticated or antiquated idea for some, actually may be the, the, the way forward for the next stage in human and intersocial development. Especially with the ages of AI collecting the preferences and the history and even the vibrational history in the cachet and the DNA and uh, a a host of different unique signatures of humanity can now be stored in digital Uh, and also with the advent of quantum computing in a quantum state. So we have the advantage of the, 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 chemi- the mineral and the chemical and the biological and then the brain and then the social and then amalgamize in a quantum structure, a quantum being uh, using the energy from the impact of, 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 uh, of collapsing gravity which does not disappear, the energy doesn't disappear. It just reforms, and it seems to be reforming in, again in our human imagination. And, and, in, and the, our ability to work with that, to see that not as confusion or chaos, but as entropy, as physical entropy of a first cause, of a, a, of a relating to a physical event that means impact uh, and, and the, uh, an outpouring of energy, a social energy. And that actually is an introduction to a thought that I was having about bureaucracy and how bureaucracy functions as a form of great energy, impact, but it seems now to have been overdeveloped in a way which has distorted 
reality or is and is now causing great imbalance and so I want to do d develop a a scientific idea as a parable to now what is happening in a social realm.